Hey guys, make sure to let your mechanic know, do not use these engine oils because they could destroy your engine. That's right, because they do not contain the proper specifications such as the new LSAC GF6A and LSAC GF6B, nor do they contain the API SP rating. This rating was come out with for the problems with the turbocharged and GDI engines. Now, most any cars nowadays, not all, contain GDI or a turbocharged engine because they're much more fuel efficient and it's a lot better than using those gas guzzlers. Now, which engine oils do we have the problem with? The Valvoline, Supertech, and Castrol. I mean, check all these oils out. As you can see, we're going through each oil to find out who has updated their motor oils because there's been plenty of time guys to make the necessary adjustments and unfortunately not all of these oil companies are really concerned about it because as I went through each oil whether it was the Castrol extended performance or the mobile one annual protection you name it the mobile one high mileage they do not all have the proper rating. Now, I will say that so far, all the mobile ones that I did check contain the proper rating. So, unless you want some pre-ignition that could damage your engine, I would definitely suggest checking your motor oils before you buy them. Maybe you even want to go and check your motor oils and take them to the mechanic yourself. This way you know you're getting the right engine oil. Because I've seen this many of times, the mechanics, they're only getting the oil that's sent to them at the best cost. You almost can't blame them. But, I'm concerned about the long-term health of my engine. I'm not sure about you guys. I'm not saying that Supertech isn't a great oil. Matter of fact, I think it's an amazing oil. I would use it if I was using oil and because it's such a great price. But now the Castrol. Definitely, I use castor oil motor oil for years, and it's a great oil as well. So, I'm not saying it's a bad oil. Valvoline, another great oil. Not saying it's a bad oil. However, guys, to me, it's just one of those deals where they should take it upon themselves to make sure they have the proper oil out for people to buy, because if I owned an engine oil company, I would want to make sure, even though I was selling the rest of the oil I already had in stock, that people also could buy the newer oil for the newer specifications. This way, it's the best of both worlds. But, I'm not saying that's not what they're trying to do. I'm not saying they're trying to rip you off or anything like that. I'm only saying, always make sure you do your research and just take a look. It only takes five seconds. You see how fast? I just grab a bottle, turn it around, look at the specifications, check it out, make sure there's no issues. The SuperTech Full Synthetic Engine Oil 10W30, you can see right there, LSEC GF5 API SN Plus. Now these are all old ratings. As always guys, I want to thank you for watching Nate's Interactive Auto. Tell us what you can about this situation.